You still got it, man. You still got this. <sighs> nice. Very nicely done. I actually picked up a landmine somewhere. Not make it through all that to be, to be killed by some lone. No, man, tell me about it. Not even, oh, I think that would have hurt me. Not, even, hurt wear, me not even wearing pants. <laughs> ah, carnage. Okay. Alright, let's charge up. Oh no, the vending machine's done. Oh. Did you use it? Um, no, I don't, I, 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 I don't. Th or did I? I don't know. I think I had to flee. No, no I had to flee because of those falling bodies. That's a shame. All right. Oh no. Oh, oh, that's not good. That's a bad sign. Oh god. That's a bad sign. Oh mate. Oh mate. Oh god. No, mate. Blade, blade, blade. Oh, okay. I mean, I'd just keep shooting them, to be honest, if I were you. Oh, man. Exactly. <laughs> not today, guys. Not today and not now. Die. I thought it sounded like Palpatine from here. Now, 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 now! Unlimited power! <laughs> I just love how much of a hold you have on this. Maybe I cause you to, to panic too much. I think my gunfire isn't helpful, nor is my presence. You seem to have much better control over this uh, when I'm not there. Well, I, have, I haven't <laughs> had to deal with any really overwhelming assaults in a while. Uh, true. <sighs> nice. Still got this. I've noticed actually. What's that? I know that obviously it's got it's got the um, laser uh, sight right. on it, but the, the characters are always always shooting from the hip. Are they? Oh yeah. Then that well yeah. It's, it's got always shooting from the hip. I know that's a really tiny <laughs> thing. It's not. It means nothing, you know, in the big skew things. It means absolutely sweet fa, but yeah. Yeah, I love the physics right down to all the bodies and like body parts and so like when one of those guys explodes there's just stuff flying everywhere. Look, you can see where he went off. There's like there were so many cor there Delicious. were so many like shredded corpses that when he blew up it left like a crater. <laughs> Do you know what this makes you think of? You know that game that came out, well, didn't come out, it's not come out. I, I actually hope it does. It's the game um not misery, what's it called? Hated? Hatred. 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 Did you see about yeah, that? Yeah, that, like, psychopath, spree... Super violent, yeah. like, yeah. Hat yeah, hatred. Yeah, the, the death simulator, if you want. Yeah. I, I, I just... It make it does make me think of that. And I was actually thinking um, earlier in this, in this playthrough, in this very session, I was thinking to myself, like, I wonder really... And this might seem stupid, but I'm like, what is really the difference when you look at that game and then you look at this game... Or any any game with zombies in it, and of course, then we go to the you know the typical like Grand Theft Auto example. But then it's the same in like Saints Row as well. Um, the way that you can kind of 
tear people to bits in so many different ways. Um, well, not tear them to bits, but you know what I mean. Like, just commit very violent acts against the general public. Why? Well, I, I, I wonder where the line gets drawn, where suddenly it becomes a real issue. Because I, I'm just thinking, I, I saw the, the trailer for Hatred, and all I was thinking was, well, I mean, I'd, I'd like to see it released, to be honest. I'd like to see that come out. I think, I actually think part of the reason for the popularity of zombies and games is that, they, is that yeah. they are, precisely that they are, um, human sh They're fantasy creatures. Well, they're fantasy, honest. not just fantasy creatures, but they're fantasy creatures that look more or less human. They're made of blood and flesh like humans, but they don't have the moral, the, but they don't yeah. have the moral status of humans. So, you know, if you, if firing a saw blade through a crowd of them, it's okay. you know, <laughs> you, you know, you don't need to feel bad about it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I actually wonder if that's something that when the person who made zombies, or, yeah, the guy who created zombies actually thought, this is great because it's literally a loophole <laughs> in which we can get away with doing whatever we want to another human being. Because it's actually, it's not quite. But it's okay because they're not actually humans. Yeah. They're now monsters as such. You know what I mean? So it doesn't matter. I do anymore. think that's a big part of the, uh, the appeal. Is that like... Oh yeah, no, definitely. No, absolutely. Like, 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 um, no. I just, I just wonder how they managed... Okay. I say normally, like, if you, um, if you want to have an enemy that, like, you know, they don't have any moral relevance, you can, you know, fight robots or whatever. But robots don't have blood or... Yeah, yeah. No, exactly. It takes away completely the, There's... that element of violence. Which, again, I find, um, funny because surely the, the, the bloodlust is there in people already. If they want to kill zombies and rip them to pieces, uh, and see the blood and stuff. Because I actually remember Carmageddon... Um, I think I've heard of that. A game I miss. Is that like a driving, like yeah, zombie oh, mate, driving so good. game or something? Yeah. Yeah, uh -oh, yeah, little, yeah. Um, but the original... point of no return ramp here. That could be ominous. Yeah. This is going to get interesting. Hit that box. Get that box. Oh, it's going dark. That's yeah. not good. Got some flares, good, good, which flares. I could use. Good. Stick by the flares if I were you. That's a good idea. That's a good. That's a good way to keep track of them, actually. <laughs> um, no, sorry. In, in Carmageddon, I'll talk while you play, but obviously stay focused on surviving. That would be cool. In Carmageddon, the, the original game was released, and the um, the, the ped pedestrians they they bled red blood, and um, and you know that was how the game was released. And then there was a big thing about it because obviously you're running over people and blah blah blah. So they turned them into zombies and gave them green blood and set oh, them no! fire. Although there were some. Oh my god! It was one of those huge guys. It was one of the exploding guys. I can't that just blindsided me. Oh no! Okay, so far. All right, we're back here then. That's fine. That's fine. Um, but yeah, th there was then a problem because it was like, oh, it's not red blood anymore. Um, <laughs> you know, it, it doesn't feel the same. So obviously, people were genuinely like, well, I want blood. You know, we paid for blood. <laughs> we, I don't. I'm not interested in green blood. I want red blood. You know. And so I kind of think, well, if that's what people want, what they want is a, you know, as close to a, a human uh, killing experience as possible without actually killing a human as, as such. Um, and so I find hatred, I find hatred to be actually somewhat of a, um, a funny point, really. Or at least certainly when, when there was a stink about it, I thought there was a bit of a moot point about it because I just thought, well... Let's be honest, we've been killing people in video games for so long. I don't know why this is a problem. It's not the 90s anymore. I didn't really get it. Um, and again, I, I, don't, I, don't, I do find that we, we, we do some mental um, acrobatics with our justification of killing zombies over people. Because uh, ultimately, as long as the blood... Like you said, you know, they're, just, they're still flesh and blood. Um, they're effectively the idiots. They're just morons. Um, the really, 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 really stupid versions of human beings. So all it is is that you're just killing dumb people, basically, and that just makes it feel terrible. <laughs> uh oh, here they come! Uh. Got it. There we go. Okay. I remember in uh, you ever you ever see a Star Trek Six? I didn't. No, no, no. I oh, okay. Well, oh. Molotov. I'm gonna drop a flare. Oh, you got it. Nice. Well, I'm dropping a flare anyway, actually. <laughs> the uh, a bunch of at one point, uh, there's this Kl a bunch of Klingons get shot on their ship while the gravity yeah. has been disabled, so they're floating around and there's blood everywhere, and it and they it's right. and it, they, it's purple, and 
on the one hand, and, and right, think, okay. Well, okay, you know, well, you know, they're, they're not human. Maybe they have weird, you know, blood biology or whatever. But I guess the actual behind-the-scenes reasons was yeah. to keep it to a PG rating. Yeah, of course, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's funny. Yeah, it's interesting how that works. I think... Because, I, I mean, I'm thinking about it now, and it, it also translates into other, other medium um, or other contexts. So, for example, you could have... You could have a woman dressed in a really, really, like a really in shape, like physically attractive woman in a bikini and put it in a PG film and you could sexualize that woman to the point of, you know, it being somewhat almost soft core pornographic. Do you know yeah. what I mean? But the moment, the moment there's even a sign of a nipple, that's it. It's over. It's done. And it, it's just kind of like, well, the nipple doesn't necessarily, the nipple suddenly becomes a stronger element of sexualization than the sexualization of the, the woman itself um and again i, I find it there's, there again there seems to be the, the mental acrobatics that people do to kind of justify that um and yeah like you say like it, it, it's still blood you know blood is blood is blood is blood but just because it's colored differently we we kind of have to see it differently and so on so yeah oh. like a detachment thing uh oh i'm on fire oh dear oh. we'll be fine oh. you'll be fine i know you'll be fine you can live. You've lived for so I long believe, through this. I know you'll do it I again. I believe in uh, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, which is one of my favorite games of recent years. Yeah. Um, All right. I believe there... I think there's some reference to, like, the the copious amounts of what is obviously blood flying out of the cyborgs you kill actually being some sort of, like, cyborg... Cyborg circulatory fluid. It's not technically blood. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wink, nudge. But it is. Yeah, I mean, of course. It's, yeah. Because it's, it's circulatory fluid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's, it's interesting. Oh, there. Oh, we dropped two health things. But then I guess... Nice. Hey. I think the game's starting to notice that we don't really care that much anymore. <laughs> <laughs> then, um, but I, I mean, I guess also, actually, one thing I did over, oversee, actually, in discussing all of this is the fact that there's the massive argument in a matter of self-defense. Obviously, if you don't kill the zombies first, then they have to kill you, which kind of over overflows everything that uh, in the matter. Like, people aren't always trying to kill you, whereas zombies are. So I guess that does justify it in that respect. Yeah. Um, I, um, oh. Oh. I'm not particularly, but... I just want to play Hatred in short, really. I, I do. <coughs> when is that coming out? I don't know. Hang on a minute. You keep you keep doing that. I'm gonna I'm gonna just quickly look this okay. up now. Da, 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 da. Here we Light. go. I'm, acti I don't, I'm activating it's, the, the Markley Light and Sound on. Spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> la, 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 da, 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 da. Now I need some like I need a I need a fog machine and like some Pink Floyd. Yeah. Oh, what? What's going on? I don't... You know what? I don't know. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's back. It's back on Steam. Um, I don't see a date, though. Oh, God. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus. Um, quarter to uh, 2015, apparently. So sometime in the second okay. quarter of this year. But I went onto the Steam page, and it was all in, like, Korean or something. So whatever that's supposed to mean for me, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. 